you are using Google Meet for your work, meeting, or even for classroom activity, for learning activity, and you don't want to face a single time when you be in a situation where you cannot hear the, your participant or your other participant of the call can't hear you. Such an annoying situation, right? Then, and you never want to be in that situation, correct? So this is a must watch video for you because in this video, I'm going to tell you step by step what exactly you need to do to fix that issue immediately. So you'll be back to conversation and every conversation will go ahead with, with Google Meet. So what are you waiting for? Let's get started. Yeah. Yeah. Sure. Thank you. So let's give a big hand to these student leaders to bring the training to you. Why don't you give a big hand here? I will show you total four type of checking to do and that will make sure that every problem has been solved. But hang on, come on, don't be worried about it. I'm not gonna show you some very difficult thing. It's super simple and super easy. And basically almost you can solve every problem with just first one type of issues, all right? So let's dive into it. And I'm telling you, it's gonna be super easy, okay? So let's say you are in the Google Meet call, going to join. So the best practice is about is about you go top right corner, you can see the lock, you click there and you make sure the connection is secure and then you turn and make sure that your camera is on, microphone is really on, notification is on. That means that all the things have been there. For some reason, if you see this one is not working correctly, you can just press the reset permissions and then you can turn them all, turn it on and then it should be working. Like almost 95% case, you will able to get the solve problem done because other things are okay, but just make sure you get your burger checkings done. So now, second way to do this one, like an example, if you've done this one and if it's still not working, then one of the things you could do, you can just go top right corner, you're gonna check the browser, you're gonna go to the setting, then you, you type mic. And then you type the mic, it's just a side settings, you click that one, then you go scroll down and you select the microphone, select the microphone. When you have the microphone, you make sure that your Google Meet call is included here, not excluded and that's the number two and that will make sure that you have pretty much well inside that one too but now now we're gonna so that's the first two things it's like 99 percent case it will be solved the next one is about is a hardware issue so one of the first thing is about make sure that your your computer is not mute mute because your computer often sometimes you're using probably mute your microphone already so if you if you put your microphone in a mac it, it was in a mute right now so you can see this one now i press it's mute right now so now unmute so make sure that if your mac you, your computer need to be unmute like that if your windows go go here in that con right now and make sure that your microphone is work uh, turned on you have not turned it off one more thing you could do is about you can actually quickly check in you can quickly come to the youtube which i often does and a lot of people make that mistake it's sometimes it, youtube can really confuse the Hi, browser my... so one of the browser like an example sometimes you put the volume really down or put yourself completely off that is one of the reasons sometimes you get impacted your computer get confused about about the about the system settings so make sure that your uh, video is fully on and and in a video and you don't need to play it just make sure that the volume settings is 100% in that one too so that's the the second thing is about what you could do on a browser setting in terms of hardware as well too so one more thing you could do is about hard hardware thing the last thing you can go in you go system preference and you you type mic and then you go to the sound and now you can see I'm speaking right now and that's already speaking here on the way and that is allowing me that make sure that my microphone is working perfectly and that's the way you can do a quick chat up as well too. So input, make sure that you select the input and you check the vibration is good. All right, so now I'm gonna show you the next problem example if you're like an example, if you join the call already, you're inside the call already, you can still go and check that these are all on. And if you're still on and if you're not listening, then you can do just quickly one thing. You can go into this one, more options, you click the settings, and then what you do, make sure that audio, you click this one, and this noise cancellation is on. Uh, push to talk is it's not a problem. Make sure that your right microphone is open. So my MacBook Pro microphone built in, I select that one too. Select that one, that will make sure that your microphone is on and off. Right now, microphone is off, microphone is on. Like an example, you can see microphone is off. So I can press it on, and now I'm gonna go into the setting right now, and now you can see the microphone is working already. So 
that's basically it that's the uh, common sh uh, troubleshooting you can get oh uh, one more thing sometimes the video doesn't work too as well so, so as i'm speaking let me show you out so then you can just click the video and make sure that your facetime camera is selected and then adjust video lighting you can turn it on that will make keep the video more lighter you can turn on this, uh, this settings and that will make your video more vibrant as well too and bingo that's all the problems you could ever have in google meet um, town settings Google Meet settings and if you just check out this one most likely like I said that the first option will get you solved and that's how you can have a great experience uh, you might want to get more tips about how to use Google Meets as a beginner to make sure that you have a good interaction through your calls check out this video right now and that can give you a quick drill and some great tips as well too and if you have not subscribed the channel go ahead and subscribe the channel we'll love to have you with me and keep talking to you let's see you in the next video